So the next thing to happen on Monday Night Raw, we get to the next segment of the night where we see Cody Rhodes. He makes his way out there to the ring, but before he can start talking, CM Punk interrupts him, and he makes his way out there. So yeah, they're going face-to-face -to -face tonight, and yeah, both of them makes their way out there to the ring, and then uh, Cody Rhodes is like, well, what do you want to talk about? And CM Punk was like, well, I know exactly what I want to talk about, and then he goes like, I want to talk about your dad. And yeah, um, CM Punk starts telling everybody a story about what Dusty Rhodes called and said. And he said that at, back in 2007, Dusty called him to make sure that he could keep an eye on his son, Cody Rhodes and stuff. Making sure he don't get in no trouble or anything like that. And he says that he never told that story and yeah, that he kept his eye on him. And he said that Cody Rhodes did perfectly fine. He had no worries about Cody or anything like that. Uh, from doing stupid stuff like other people. So yeah, that's what CM Punk was talking about there. But then, he says that the only reason he brought up Cody Rhodes' dad is because he kind of feels bad. And what he feels bad about is that he's going to be breaking a promise this Saturday at the Rumble. And uh, he says that he has to be the one to win the Royal Rumble match. So yeah, that's what he says. He says he just feels bad for breaking that promise, you know. Uh, and yeah, that's what he was saying. And then Cody Rhodes was talking about how him and CM Punk, they follow different paths, but somewhat similar and stuff. Uh, and he says that uh, that he wanted to talk about the pipe bomb, and he mentions the pipe bomb and all that stuff, and how it inspired so many people just like himself. It inspired himself, and yeah, that's what he was talking about. But then he says that, uh, that CM Punk had this torch, uh, where he was main eventing and all that stuff. And instead of passing the torch, he just straight up left it and dropped it on the ground. He did not care who picked up that torch. But he says that he was the one that picked up the torch for like the last two years and tried to hold it up and all that. So yeah, that's what Cody Rhodes was talking about right there. And then CM Punk starts talking about, uh, you know, about him going through like the independence scene. Uh, and stuff, and that Cody Rhodes didn't have to go through the independence scene because, you know, his last name, Rhodes, uh, that he went straight to OVW and all that stuff, and Cody Rhodes was like, yeah, I, I went straight to OVW, and you had to scratch your claw, claw your way through the independence scene to get to OVW to get on the main roster and all that, and, uh, yeah, uh, CM Punk was talking about how he did not see Cody Rhodes as the American Nightmare, uh, Dusty Rhodes, because he says that everybody sees Dusty Rhodes in him, but he says that he sees him as one person, that is Cody Rhodes. So yeah, that's what Punk was talking to Rhodes about there, but then he says that, uh, and then he starts taking off his jacket and all that, and he says uh, that he hopes that they can still be friends after Saturday, uh, on Sunday and all that stuff, because he's going to eliminate him in the Rumble, and he's even though Cody Rhodes wants to finish his story, he says that he has to be the one to finish his own. So, yeah, that's what CM Punk was talking about there. And then uh, Cody Rhodes starts talking about... And Cody Rhodes is talking about that he's more CM Punk than CM Punk himself. And I forgot to mention one part. CM Punk did actually mention his own dad. Talking about his dad was an electrician and all that stuff. And how he didn't have a famous last name like Cody. And he says that, oh wait, his dad was more blue collar than Cody Rhodes, huh? And so yeah, that's what happened there. And uh, Cody Rhodes was not happy about that. And uh, yeah, uh, CM Punk was talking about how uh, you claim to be more CM Punk and all that. But he says that he got to go, uh, you know, that he got to eliminate him and finish his own story. And CM Punk, uh, Cody Rhodes says that there goes the old CM Punk once again. Only thinking about himself. And he says, well, here's one thing I gotta say. And he quote, and he sends like a quote from his dad or whatever that his dad got from like John Wayne or whatever. Um, and he was talking about how he's going to be going through CM Punk at the Rumble and finishing his own story. So yeah, that's what he says. And they both got face to face. And yeah, like it was about to be a brawl, but it did not happen. So yeah, that's what happened there. Great segment though. I really liked it. Uh, Pretty much 5 out of 5. That's why I'll give it 5 stars. Right there. A great segment between CM Punk and Cody Rhodes. Definitely can't wait for the Rumble now. But up next, it'll be Indy Hartwell and Candice LeRae versus Shayna Baszler and Zoe Stark in a tag team match. It's still to come later on tonight in the main event. It'll be Damian Priest versus Drew McIntyre 1-1. -on -one. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Until the next thing that happens on Monday Night Raw. See you guys later. Until then.